I grew up with many breeds of dogs and horses. I have had 23 different dogs in my life and counting. I attended the San Francisco SPCA Academy for Dog Trainers, an amazing and comprehensive program. I feel confident in saying that the curriculum and its application is really the best in the industry. It is actually referred to as the Harvard of dog training. So I guess I can say that I attended a Harvard. I am also certified Tellington t Church practitioner. Their approach is an excellent complement to the education I received at the Academy. I am also a certified Canaan strength and conditioning coach which is quite different than the rehabilitation work that a DVM might do with a dog. My certification is geared towards helping pet dogs, senior dogs, and dogs competing in sports to be well-rounded physically. I love this type of work because not only is it, is it the best way to avoid injuries in all kinds of dogs, even just regular pet dogs, but it's also an excellent way to keep our dogs mentally sharp and stimulated. Working as a trainer in a shelter environment was one of the most rewarding things I have done in my career as a dog pro. It exposed me to working with all kinds of dogs with the clock ticking. So it helped me become very astute at problem solving and training efficiently. My area of practice is in behavior modification. In a nutshell, I am called when pet parents are having issues with their dog that they do not understand or know how to resolve. I personally love working with rowdy adolescent puppies and dogs with emotional issues such as anxiety, aggression, and fear. I wish clients, all people for that matter, realized that loving a dog is not enough. Sure, Love and bonding are part of the package of living with a dog, yet dogs are constantly being misunderstood. And that creates a lot of difficulty for the dogs living in our world and their human companions. So I wish people would educate themselves in the ethology of dogs. Great question. The client that is willing to partner with me and their dog to see progress in our work together. The client that is willing to practice with their dog between sessions. I might add, the client who is also fair to their dog at the, as the dog is learning new skills and fair to the process of behavior modification. Mm -hmm.